well, 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 what do we have here? Professor Ello, a.k.a. Wu-Tang, a.k.a. Tangalang, sweet language. Group. Subscribe to the channel, please. Before I start this video, hit that like button. You know it's going to be that real spill, that real deal. That real tea. Um, but anyways, I came on here to speak about, um, you know, uh, words and also manipulative provocateurs, um, you know, the thing is, There are people in this world who hate you because you're winning, plain and simple. Plain and simple. They don't know what you're going through behind closed doors. They don't know what you've been going through for the past uh, couple of years. They don't even know if you're absolutely winning um, according to yourself. They just look on the outside looking in and say, oh man, this person is winning, winning, winning. You could be going through some of the hardest things you ever been through in your life. Whole time. What they see on the outside is the fact that you winning. So they gonna slander your name without saying your name. They gonna uh, <clears throat> give indirect threats, indirect warnings that they, indirect threats that they try to uh, use as warnings all because of the hate that they have for you you going through whatever you ne they they don't know what you're going through but they steady putting their foot down and kicking you while you down meanwhile you might not know where your next meal coming from you might not know how you're gonna get to work the next day you might not know um if you're going to have the funds or whatever to gas up your vehicle to be able to take care of the necessary things. But the whole time, they'll sit back here and sit up there and try to judge you, which God is the ultimate judge. You know what I'm saying? But they'll sit back here and up there and try to judge you for being you. And then they'll tell you, um, oh, you, you not being yourself, you not being yourself. Meanwhile, the whole damn time, you're being yourself. The problem is, they just don't like who you be. You could be being yourself, and then you have people say, man, that muck need to be they self. That muck need to be they self. But you looking like, damn, I'm, I am who I am. I'm being who I am. And that's a, uh, a righteous individual, but not overly righteous. Meaning, yes, I do walk in the ways of the Lord. I do have my mishaps. I do pray to the Heavenly Father. I don't pray to Satan. But I have my mishaps as well, where I'm not overly righteous. So when you listen to uh, Professor Ello, aka Wu Tang, aka Tanga Lang, which is I, who is I, you're going to hear some things that you don't want to hear. My thing is if it bothers you that much, don't listen to it. Plain and simple. You're not forced to listen to the music that I put out. You don't know when I made what music. You don't know if I made certain songs 10 years ago, eight years ago. You don't know if it's part of my growth or not. And honestly, it's not my duty to explain that. 
to anybody. Because at the end of the day, people are going to hate you, whether you're doing bad or doing good. <laughs> and they going to laugh. But you got to be okay with them laughing. Because that what that is what that is is it's a part of their it's a part of their pride, you know. It helps them feel prideful. They feel good, you know. Oh, I'm able to laugh at this person. <laughs> Look at them. They doing bad. They doing terrible. Whole time they don't even know you might be playing a fool. They don't even know that you understand things on such a high level that it's unfathomable. How you keep pushing, pushing through and destroying these devils. So at the end of the day, yes, I'm a good man, person to person, conversation, respectful, hold the door for women. Um, you know, tell, let women, tell women chivalry ain't dead. You know, um, when I speak with my wife, I've grown to start speaking with sense. When I speak with my children, when they piss me off, sometimes I feel like if I'm about to snap off, sometimes I, have, I say nothing at all. But you people who are so internet driven and this is your whole entire life you're not finna make this my whole entire life where i gotta put the exact real me all out on display just for you to judge no i will give you a part of me on the internet because yes we are a part of the internet world but you're not getting the hundred percent real me unless you are my circle and i know that you care for me and I care for you, but man, let me put it like this. They don't know how many times that some of you out there who actually doing well on the outside looking in, they don't know how many times you almost passed. They don't know how many losses you done took. They don't know what uh, cause or, um, or situations you had with the uh, doctors. They don't know um, what kind of threats you may have received they don't know what time of the day you're awake taking care of business they don't know the pain you feel and guess what quite frankly they don't care so at the end of the day I'm a grown ass man and say this to yourself you're a grown ass man you're a grown ass woman a grown man do what the heck he want to do only a boy do what he can do Grr.